Projected Coordinate System. Nearly all maps are an attempt to represent our environment in a two-dimensional format. The act of systematically transposing a 3D to a 2D object is called projection. And it's a key concept of cartography, the art and science of making maps. The Earth is not flat, it's a spheroid. And it's impossible to completely accurately flatten a spheroid. Converting a sphere to a flat surface results in distortion. To create maps, we use projections. Equal area projections preserve the area of displayed features. The size of a feature on a map is the same relatively to its size of the, on the Earth. In an equal area map, the shapes of most features are distorted. Conformal projections preserve local shape and the country boundaries look the same on the map as they do on the Earth. A conformal map distorts area. Most features are depicted too large or too small. Equidistance maps preserve the distances between certain points. Most equidistance projections have one or more lines in which the length of the line on a map is the same length at map scale as the same line on the globe. Because maps are flat, some of the simplest projections are made onto geometric shapes that can be flattened like cylinders, cones and planes. The Mercator projection is one of the most common cylindrical projections and the equator is usually its line of tangency. The conic projection is tangent to the globe along a line of latitude. The meridians are projected onto the conical surface meeting at the apex or point of the cone. This type of projection is usually tangent to the globe at one point. The point of contact may be the North Pole, the South Pole, a point on the equator or any point in between. One easy way to understand how map projections alter spatial properties is to visualize shining a light through the Earth onto a surface, called the projection surface. Imagine that the surface of the Earth, represented by a translucent sphere, has rectangles of the same size in the equatorial zone and close to the poles. If we wrap the Earth with a piece of paper and project a light from the center of it, the distorted shadow will be projected on the sheet of paper and thus we can see why the maps look so different from each other. Cartographers choose the map projections that best represent the purpose, size and shape of the area of interest on the map.